Hey guys, it's Gene, aka LS Turbo Intig, and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to install the H3R Performance Fire Extinguisher along with the Course Motorsports Quick Release Cam Lock that will be mounted to my Hego Row Cage. Um, I decided to go with the smaller 1.4 pound fire extinguisher only because I wasn't sure if the 2.5 pound bottle was going to fit uh, in my Cayman so I decided to go with the 1.4. I may buy one later but for now I'll, I'll work with the 1.4. But here it is guys. Um, I did pick up the chrome finish. I thought about going with black but I felt like maybe you wouldn't see it in the car and because my car is in car shows I did want it to kind of stand out so um, they do have red but nothing in my car is red so I thought maybe that just wouldn't go with the color theme so I decided to go with chrome which I think really came out to be a good choice to go with. You better sit down, you just shut your mouth Cause I don't need a man to make me feel fine Better sit down, you just shut your mouth Yeah You think you can Put your hands on my body I'm no damsel in distress Come too close I'm Now I did do quite a bit of research to figure out how to mount the extinguisher to the roll cage and there was actually a lot of different manufacturers out there or aftermarket companies that provide this solution but I decided to go with Course Motorsports only because of the blue cam lock feature uh, as well as the black hardware that attaches the fire extinguisher to the cam lock itself and it does come in a variety of colors you do have to select the right size for your roll cage. Also your extinguisher, you have to select the correct diameter, whether it's a 3 inch or a 2.63 inch. Now this can be mounted anywhere in your vehicle, um, but because I was going to mount it to the roll cage, I had to also order the billet roll cage clamp that comes in a variety of sizes from 1.5 inch all the way to two and a quarter. And they do come in aluminum, black, and I think that's all they carry. So I did order this as well. There is an option for Porsche owners for fire extinguishers. And they do sell it on Renline. It is the uh, Renline fire extinguisher and mount package. And this basically mounts in front of the passenger seat. And I think it hooks onto the seat rails or the hardware at least where the attachment points are underneath the seat but I felt like it was just going to be in the way of the passenger since my wife does put her purse in front of her so I didn't want an extinguisher to be in the way so this is the reason why I went with the cam lock quick release for the roll cage assembly wise guys it was really easy it's just it's all mechanical
can't forget what you'll die The way you act won't take me back Just go, go, go Go, go, go Yeah, I can't forget what you'll die The way you act won't take me back Just go, go, go Go, go Cause I just wanna go, go, go to the deep end I just wanna go Alright guys, let me show you how easy it is to remove the extinguisher. All you have to do is pull down on the blue clutch here and simple as that. That's what remains on the roll bar. You can see the attachment to the extinguisher itself stays on and to put it back, just put it right there. Easy peasy. Looks really good. Um, the Course Motorsports quick release comes in a variety of colors. Um, I've seen this in red, bronze, um, even the the bracket here for the extinguisher and the attachment to the roll bars. You can get them in polished, black, and I think that's it. Oh, chrome. Again, comes off. Puts right back on. Easy peasy, guys. If you guys are thinking about getting an extinguisher for your car, I would highly recommend get one from HDR Performance, as they do come in a variety of sizes. Uh, I specifically wanted to get one that came with a gauge. I may upgrade to the next size up. But I wasn't sure if it fit in my car. So, what do you guys think? If you love my content, please consider subscribing. I've got a lot more Porsche content coming in this year. I do have some carbon fiber side intakes coming in from TAKD Carbon. So I will have an install video on that once those come in. And I am still debating on what kind of carbon fiber hood to go with. I'll post a couple pictures. You guys tell me which one you think I should go with with my build here.
Also fam, uh, upcoming videos is the seatbelt replacement from Seatbelt Planets. Uh, I was supposed to do this last year, uh, but I ran out of time. So this year I'm going to get around to doing it. Um, I will be doing it in a blue color. Uh, I've got a bunch of samples I need to uh, decide which one to go with. Tell me which one you guys think I should go with. I'll post a picture here. Alright fam, that'll do it for this video. Uh, hit that subscribe button, uh, hit those post notifications, that way when I drop those videos you guys will be notified. And thank you for tuning in. Have a wonderful and blessed day fam. Until next time.